Hey, how's it going? My name is Yvonne Christine. I am a Twitch streamer at twitch.tv slash Yvonne Christine. If you know me or my channel, then you are familiar with this sound. Slice! No, are you kidding? And today I'm going to show you how to make it. I'm going to go to streamelements.com. From here, we are going to go to loyalty and within loyalty, we are going to go to the stream store. We are going to create a new item. We are going to call this or select sound effects for the item type. And then we are going to call this item time lady. The description. Um, so we're going to call it time lady W O or walk on, uh, item cost is zero. I do not make people spend points for, to play sounds on my channel and we have unlimited stock. There is no cooldown, and you don't have to do anything with category. Let's click next. From here, we are going to upload the sound. Now I've already uploaded it here. But if it's not here in your selection, you will have to go to upload and drag and drop the sound here before you can select it from the list. I'm going to crank it up to 100%. I recommend this because you can control the sound from OBS rather than controlling the sound from uh, stream elements. We don't want it redeemable via website. We don't want it redeemable via extension. And we don't want a confirma confirmation that it was sent in the chat because the confirmation is the sound. Item command, I am just going to call it time lady. Remember that you call your command um, this. This is important for the future. Click next. And then we're going to save it. So now the item has been created. That is one out of three of the steps that we have to complete. Next step, we are going to create an overlay. The overlay allows you to play the sound within OBS. So we're going to go to new overlay. I let the resolution stay as is. Click start. You can add a widget from here or here. Hover over alerts and then click store redemptions. Now there's a few things that you're given right at the start that you don't care about. For instance, we don't care about an image. We only care about the sound. We don't care about a message. Again, we only want to hear the sound. So within the settings, let's upload that sound again. Crank it. And name it. We're going to click save here. Okay. Things of note. If you already have a sound overlay in your OBS, there's nothing more to do here. But if you don't have one, you are going to want to click this link here. You're going to want to go to your OBS. I use Streamlabs. Let me drag it over. Uh, it's going to be tel uh, telescoped for a while so I can show you what's going on. And so every single one of my redeemed sounds play out of here. But if I didn't have this, what I would do is I would add the source, add browser source. We're going to just call it temp source. We'll close this and now it's added, but since I don't need this, I'm going to delete it. And the reasons why is because if I left it, I would have the noise play double and you don't want that. Okay. So that's two out of the three steps. The final step is creating the actual command so we can use it in chat. So let's go to our chat bot. Let's go to chat commands, custom command, add new command, 
and we are going to call it time lady now do you remember when i said it's going to be important for you to remember what you call it because that is going to be the response to the trigger so what you would put here is you would put dollar sign and i don't know what this bracket is called so we're just going to call it the curvy bracket uh redeem time lady and then close curvy bracket I'm going to go to advanced settings. I'm turning all the cooldowns off. Now, I do have it in my stream where there are certain keywords that you can use to trigger events. So let me show you. Let me activate Time Lady's command first. And then let me show you the clapping command itself. What I've done. So if you type clap if you type people clap or if you type easy clap in chat you don't have to type exclamation point clap exclamation point clap is an option but i'd rather have it happen naturally so if people just want to type in clap and see the animation of the clapping the clap is going to actually play so these are like they don't have to know the commands there are specific words and things that you can use so things will trigger if that's how you want it to happen for you in your stream. So now that we have Time Lady's command all set up, we have done the sound redemption, we have done the overlay, and we have done the command. Let's test it. So let's go back to my channel. And here we are just going to type in Time Lady. Ta-da! It is the best thing when it works out. <laughs> so that is the command. That's not necessarily the walk-on. That is a different program, different setup. If you guys would like to see how I actually create walk-ons, please let me know in the comments below. But that is going to be it for creating sounds via stream elements. You can catch me on twitch.tv slash Yvonne Christine. Thank you again so much for being here and I will see you next time. Bye.